recently he hasn't been getting amazing results, but still very solid. He's definitely not somebody to sleep on. And yeah, he, he's been having a little bit of a, I wouldn't say character crisis, but just like everyone started to kind of download how he plays. Uh-huh. Uh, but I mean, it's not like he's a bad player. Right, right, right. It's and I mean, in Midwest Mayhem, he placed ninth, but his losses were to Mr. R and Hyuga. Yeah. So, so they're all legit losses. Yeah, that's nothing to be ashamed of. Like, you could easily get, like, fourth or third with those losses. It's just the bracket kind of messed him up. Yeah, so so not going to Smashville. That's very oh, rare yeah. for uh, JJ. Yeah, JJ really likes Smashville. Um, Big Sean with Bowser. I feel like Town and City is going to help Bowser a ton. Oh yeah, if he if he can get the the Koopa, as I like to call <laughs> it, uh, really early, like he, he can kill like 90th or 80 at this point, I think, at this stage. Yeah. But JJ also gets the uh, the the new hoo ha, up where throw up, air? up throw up air, yeah, which which is only really a thing in this stage, like, to kill with anyway. Uh huh. But yeah, uh, especially after the nerfs to Bowser where uh, they increased the knockback growth on his up throw. Yeah. So now it's not just a guaranteed kill setup once you get past a certain percent. There's a window. Yeah. And that window is going to be a lot bigger on this stage. Yeah. Also, like, that was that was a really good... Like, everyone was kind of upset about it at first. It was a really good patch because it was... The fact that it was, like, a very big window before was kind of stupid. Yeah, that was... It was pretty jank before. But a uh, good up smash from JJ converting off that banana. That I banana. Think. Yeah, that's that's how they do it. Yeah, I was gonna say Big Sean was actually doing very well. Uh huh. He almost had it, and I'm not sure is up throw up air gonna connect here. Uh, it might with no rage. Yeah, I'm not super familiar with Bowser. All I know is jabs and grabs a lot. Yeah, jab, do jab, do get 10%. And yeah, Big Sean was off to a great start, but I think JJ just kind of suddenly got the download and is running away with this. Oh. Oh yeah, he obviously doesn't want to. Also, he uh, as hopefully everyone knows, uh, he can't coop aside. In, right. in this because you will die first as Koopa. Mm -hmm. uh, so he, he's got to win. It's not like Gandorf where he can just you know get the, the easy win. Yeah, it, or like 1.0.0 yeah. when they die at the same time so Bowser would get the win. Yeah, no, nowadays some characters can even survive it. Yeah, Villager can make it. I think Rosalina can make it. At least Shulk as far as can like, make it. Oh, Shulk is the if it's dropped, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that was really risky. But a good... DI out, I think. Yeah. He got hit by a weird starting hitbox, yeah, so they it, didn't all chain connect it, it, it was kind of. I think it might have been. Oh, that was that, That's at probably going to kill. Nope. Bowser's what am I saying? It's Bowser. <laughs> oh, yeah, and he's having trouble getting back to the stage. I think I mean, most heavies share that problem, where it's it, just. It's especially a problem for Bowser. Bowser just. Uh, he's such a heavyweight now that. And none of his aerials really have good frame data. Uh huh. Um, I think the best option for him is like there's I think there's like a quick get up you can do. I I don't think it's true. Never mind. I was gonna say a quick get up where you can just like jump into up B. Oh, football toss still not gonna do it. And Bowser with this much rage can be very scary, especially on Town and City. That's but gonna that's gonna it, do it. Banana into forward smash is you know one of the one of the strongest confirms. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've died at like 80 to that. Well, you're also it's playing nasty. Rosalina, but yeah, that is it's it's ridiculous, especially even against the Bowser. That's gonna kill like. What, 120 or something like that? Probably. Especially you, you if, you're, if you're right next to him, you can just charge a little bit and then get the extra damage. Yeah, do not mess with, bana with Banana Diddy Kong, but specifically Banana. Yeah, especially Banana. <laughs> just, just just grab the banana and eat it. All right, so we're going to Lilac Cruise. Yeah, I think uh, the rationale behind this might just be, like, he wants to kind of slow JJ down, yeah. put him on some weird terrain, try and see if he can get some momentum back and get something going. Yeah, I mean he has up throw combos. Uh huh. So so definitely not uh, not someone we can just like sleep on because you know a lot of Bowser's it's kind of hard to say if they're actually like able to play the character. Right. Uh, but you know having having even that, that kind of follow up is already like also he's winning. Yeah, he's off to a great yeah. start. Like he just kind of ran in there like all right this is my game I'm gonna take this back. And that's that's the best mindset to have too. But uh, JJ making this comeback pretty quickly. Like. That, that's the thing about the heavyweights in this game, is they have crazy good advantaged states, but they also have crazy bad disadvantaged states. So one or two neutral interactions can just lead to a stop. Yeah. Like, every combo is going to put on at least 50% one way or the other. And, and then... Like, the only way it's really beneficial is if you don't die as fast. Uh-huh. But, like, for a long time, I mean, they've gotten a lot better with the balancing as far as... Okay, oh, okay, he does is. have it. He does have the Koopa. Yeah, no rage um, there, so it helped it connect. Yeah. 
But yeah, like like uh, a lot of characters, especially when the game first came out, a uh -huh. lot of the heavyweights had the problem of they have just really bad like unfair bad frame data for how like yeah. how this game worked. There was also some really crazy characters back in the day. Oh yeah, like, like 1.0.0 Rosa and Sheik. Oh yeah, that, that's they were too. insane. And when Yoshi with his frame safe uh, dash attack that le led into up air. Oh yeah, Diddy Kong not ever being able to be comboed. That was oh, yeah. awesome. Oh yeah, and also Diddy Kong, uh, the Wectoring, and Diddy Kong. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, Big Sean in the lead right now. He might. I'm not entirely sure, but he might be able to get the uh, the uh, the Koopa. Yeah, with this amount of. Oh, oh wow. Yeah, that has good read on Big Sean. That's got invincibility on it too. Yeah. The, the, his, uh, if I remember correctly, the entire shell is invincible the entire time. Yeah, I think that might be one of the few moves that can beat out um, Monkey Flip Kick. Yes. Because Monkey Flip Kick goes through a lot of stuff, but if you got invincibility, yeah. there's who, no real beating you. Who, who, who needs like damage or anything else when you have invincibility? But it also has damage. Yeah, it's, it's a good move. I mean, you can't just throw it out there, but yeah. if you can get a read, it's a really solid option. All right, so now we're going to JJ's favorite stage. JJville. And yeah, this might be a bit of a slaughter. Like, I mean, I'm not going to count Big Sean out, especially when he's playing Bowser and he can get some crazy combos. Yeah, but especially, and also how, with how well he played last match. Yeah, but we're on JJ's home court. He's had two games to download Big Sean. I would not put a lot of confidence in Big Sean. Like, if I, if I were to bet on this, I would definitely bet on JJ here. Mm. But... Yeah, like, uh, I, I think I think he might have intentionally tried to get to the banana there. Maybe I feel like JJ was the one controlling that because he was. Like, oh a yeah, lot yeah, less yeah percent. that's right. If I was in Big Sean's situation and I had the steering wheel I, on I that one, right I would have just gone stage. off. Yeah. Yep. So no, um, Quilly, uh, he's like Ooh, he's banana like, F smash. He's, like tested out like all the the exact percentages where he can control it. Uh huh. Ooh, that was a good jab. Yeah, that that just got two good options, and they're jab and grab. Yep. Everything else is a question mark. Everything else is situational, but if you're in, in if you're in doubt, just either jab or grab, whichever one you didn't do last. Get that either 320, 10% damage from jab, Ooh. or get that beautiful grab into whatever you want. Yeah, and l like I said, JJ's kind of running away with this. Oh, but this that, could be it. Yep. There. there also, it is. I was gonna say I think he intentionally put that banana down, but it was already uh, it already landed once, so. The downside about banana, once it lands, it's uh, thrown twice, it disappears. Yeah, that's such a weird thing in this game. Like every other game with Diddy, when you throw the banana, it just stays out for a set time. Ooh, good down B there. But, oh, is Peanut gonna save him? Nope. Ooh, there it is. This is starting to get scary for JJ. One more big combo, and he could be a kill percent to, for, to the Koopa. Oh, yeah. Um, oh, but oh, that's it. it. Garbage man. Take yep. out the trash. A pretty close set. Very I gotta close say, set. I was yeah. expecting that to be pretty one-sided, but Big Sean not to be slept on. That that's a that's a scary uh, that's a very scary Bowser. Mm -hmm. Having because we don't have like a Bowser, no. and Bowser is more like if you don't know how to play against him, and you and you, especially if you don't have a character who can camp against them, he's a scary thing to deal with. Oh yeah, his punish game is off the charts.